How you doing everyone? Welcome back to All The Mods 8. In today's episode, we are going to focus on getting that refined obsidian pickaxe. All those enchantments that we got from the Wandering Trader last episode. I really want to get straight onto that, but there's a lot of steps to be able to do that. At the moment, I'm currently at the spawn area because this map is going to be very shortly... Well, probably by the time this video goes out, the, the Patreon server is now active. Uh, my Let's Play World is going to be available to Patreons. And this is the spawn area that I've chosen. Nothing too crazy, but it is practically ready to rock. Um, it's a little bit different from the original that I saw. Um, because I've deleted chunks, and I've literally deleted everything around, I probably have to do it again now, to be honest, now I think about it. But uh, my base is... Oh, God. My base is like that way somewhere and yeah I, I'm, I'm I need to see what the damage is to be honest to the world it's a little bit tricky especially when this was a plains biome originally all the way back here to these ma like like these like weird cliffs and stuff but yeah I'll, I'll make sure that it gets one final um, purge I'm gonna call it a purge uh, before we go live on the uh, with the server, so this is where the patrons will kind of start off, and they've got all the villagers and villages that they need to keep going, get some community farms going. They've got houses that they can take and stuff like that. Um, yeah, and I will probably be living here casually for a while, and and just to get my, like. Like I said last episode, we're gonna be like I'm gonna be like having two bases. I'm gonna have a let's play base and a casual base. Uh, casual base is gonna be completely separate, so that way I can merge everything together, stay close to my patrons. Happy days. Um, yeah, good little spot really. Um, like I say, this forest wasn't here to begin with because if you look at the map, uh, let's focus on me. Um, you can see where I've kind of there's the, like the light green is all the planes and then the the new generation has kind of given it a different biome it kind of looks cool though if i'm honest and hopefully it stays this way when i redo it again uh once i finish uh recording and stuff and doing my back-to-backs but yeah hopefully this is this is how it's going to be it's going to be pretty cool because it's just I don't know, it's kind of shielded off by the new world gen. It, it looks really cool. All these uh, trees and that is kind of really sort of fencing this little spawn village off. It's really cool. And I've marked it on as a waypoint now. So I, I know know where we're going. Uh, the only downside is, actually, have I got a... Yeah, I've got a waystone here. I could totally put this, plonk this down somewhere. Um, I don't really know where to put, put it for now. Uh... I guess anywhere would do. Where's somewhere that makes sense? Uh, I'll just put it... To, no. I need to put it... Like, there's nowhere really to put it, and it hasn't actually got one. I am wasting fuel, but that's fine. Is it dark, or is it... Is it night? Sunset. Okay. It's fine. We can sleep. Um, I'm probably just going to stick it by the fountain, if I'm honest. Just going to put it here. Oh, we ain't going to call it that. We're going to call it spawn. There we go. I've already got one. Yeah, that's kind of cool. I kind of like that. That's neat. So people can just come along here. And when it goes online, I'm going to put a little sign to say it was established on such and such a date. Um, it went online that date. I should really sleep. But today, this isn't, this isn't the main focus. Today, I want to kind of really get this refined pickaxe that I've got here with these enchantments for now i f i feel like but that is quite a mission so that that's my focus because this will harvest oh god it's so noisy around here can i get my jetpack charged up a little bit or do i not have enough juice in my back oh god no i don't but this is going to be awkward wait no it ain't we can just teleport now because i've just done this but i don't have enough xp because i've drained it so I need to go and get some XP's from somewhere. Okay, there's chickens in there. Uh, FYI, I've also put a... I've crafted a mega torch. So that this place stays as safe as possible. And the villagers can be preserved. 
I'm pretty sure that everyone's gonna kind of take the the, the villagers hostage. I would definitely. It's very it's, there's a lot going on here. Lots of houses and stuff. Uh, this one not so great. Uh, let's have a look in here. What have we got? Um, no, I'm not I'm not bothered. But yeah, there's a lot. I haven't really raided it to be honest. And the chests, as long as players don't break the chests, as you can see, it, it was gold just a minute ago. It's gone blue. Um, everyone gets a shot at the loot, which is really cool. Um, as long as you don't break the chest. There's lots of loot going on around here. There's lots of stuff. Lots of stuffs. Oh, hello. Uh, don't really need any of this, to be honest. Don't need anything here either. Um, so yeah, uh, I need to get back home, and I need more. I need more stuffs. I suppose I could cook those. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna uh, get some XP. Uh, cook some of these or something. I don't know. Oh, I could make some toast. I'll just take them anyway, actually. And we got sticks. I, I should just chop down a tree or something. I'll, top, I'll chop down this oak tree. I don't want to make too much of a mess at spawn right now. Vein mine it. And where did I get that from? Wait, what? Where did I get stone brick stairs from? And I have no saplings no saplings oh yeah you can see look you can see this tree this is the, this is where i've been chopping it down that's the only downside is when when it changes the biome i didn't think it would change the biome to be honest because uh, it was plains before and now it's whatever they, this is what is it what are you come on tell me you're still a plains biome technically don't know why it's changed but it's i i think it's kind of cool I, I kind of like it. I kind of like the fact that, yeah, you got some derpy trees. We can cut them down. That's fine. Um, but apart from that, I, I feel like this is really cool. I like it. It kind of seals it away from the big bad world and stuff. So I'm going to make some, some charcoal real quick. I'm going to get back home. I just need the XP uh, and we're all good. Finally back at base and I feel like we need to put this jetpack straight on charge and my backpack actually while I'm thinking about it. Uh, we'll just charge that up and uh, is there another charge point that I can charge? Can I not charge? Hmm. I forgot what I've done. Um, anyway, so there is a quite a few steps. There's quite a few steps that we need to do. We need to do fluid extractors and latex processing units first. They're the first step in all of this. Then we got to kill some um, animals, which is fine because they need to be... I need to kind of calm them down a bit. And that way we can get pink slime. I don't know why, but it's just what the mod wants. So it's exactly what we're going to do, right? Because that's how we roll. Um, let's get our backpack charged. Let's just charge that up real quick. It's really hard to tell when that's done, but we'll come back in a second. But we need the fluid extractors first, and... Oh, God. Wait. How are we supposed to get plastic from... No, sorry. Fluid extractors. I was going to say, how are we going to get plastic if we can't get the plastic? Right, so to get plastic, we need to kind of cook, like latex we got we need to get latex from wood right and the best way we can do that is make these fluid extractors i believe they don't need power fluid extractors so we need i would like to get four of these so ooh, so we need a lot of wood uh we got any wood logs uh i've got three on me have we got any more any more wood logs i mean that four is not enough Oh, okay. Dark oak logs. There we go. Uh, so we need dark oak logs. We need iron, cobblestone of sorts. Uh, yeah. So let me get four of these, and I'm going to craft. I'm going to actually no. I'll just do it on camera. So I want four of you. Uh, we need four pistons. We're going to need some iron. I feel like I'm getting really low on iron. And we are. We got like literally next to none. If I got a ore hammer, ore hammer, no, no. Okay, we we'll just crush it. It's fine. The ore hammer, this will do. Uh, where's the crusher? 
That's the enrichment chamber. Where's my crusher? There it is. That should do it. I thought I could crush you. Maybe not. Okay, whatever then. Whatevs, Trevs. We just go with the, the what, what what we've got. That's fine. Just go for twenty five. I'm not gonna bother. I mean, it's, we're gonna be filthy rich anyway. It's not not a problem. So we need cobblestone of sorts. So that is you. And then we've got to wait for you. Yeah. Oh, we got we got eight iron dust there. We got any more? No. Right. Uh, yeah, okay. I'm going to wait for this to cook and I'm going to grab all the rest of the resources so we can speed this up a little bit. Pretty much done on this recipe. I accidentally made one by accident, but... Uh, oh, we ain't, we ain't got enough iron. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Sad times. This is very sad times indeed. Oh, God. Like, literally, we have chewed through our iron. It's gone... Like, we got more diamonds than we got iron right now. I was actually mad. I mean, maybe we can't do four then. I mean, we've got two. We could probably get three. I would like four. Yeah, we definitely can't get four. I mean, I could get... I got fortune on this pickaxe, so I could go and grab some iron. Yeah, I'm going to do that. So it turns out, where I was getting all the dirt to terraform... Yeah, iron is... You bet. I like. I've been strip mining for a while down below, and and this is by far the best place to get your your iron at the moment. Especially if you've got the old mining dimension where it kind of gives you end stone and stuff. I'm not sure until I reset this. This this all will get reset anyway because of the uh, the Patreon server coming up, and I need to probably delete some cobblestone. But yeah, we got more than enough now. I I feel like the only thing I th feel like actually yeah I, I need to go and get some redstone because i feel like redstone is going to be a problem real soon so yeah i need to go and find some of that quick progress report i'm literally trying to find the sweet spot level for redstone and the ones that i think it's going to be on it's not however on the bright side i have got a ton of iron now like and coal uh, i'm literally swimming in it right now i'm swimming in iron and coal however redstone is going to be our kryptonite right now um yeah i'm getting lots of uh, uranium as well too which is going to be good uh but yeah lots and lots of iron as you can see and coal like don't forget the fuel and then yeah where's redstone uh, to be continued with this and i'm munching through my like no pun intended but i'm munching through my food here because vein miner kind of makes you really hungry Hmm, I don't know. To be continued. I mean, I, I could go lower. I don't think it's going to be lower, though. I don't know. So, I'm practically, like, starving here. I've literally got... I'm trying to get some food together. Also, my pickaxe is almost dead. And there's... I, I literally tunneled down, straight down, with my jetpack and stuff. And there's just no redstone. So I might have to just do this in the overworld because the mining dimension is a little bit squiffy. I'm just going to have to go to some random area and just dig because it's going to get purged anyway. I might as well just do that. But look how much iron I've got. And I've got even more, like I've kept loads of cobblestone for building and stuff uh, in the future. But look how much copper we've got as well. We've got like tons of that and all, like tons, like stupid amount. Like, literally, this is just for ore hammers and stuff for now. Um, I don't know what I'm going to use it for later. But we've only got 19 redstone. So the hunt continues. I'll be back when, when I've actually got some. So I've gone into a normal cave system here. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to not vein mine just to get some durability back up on my pickaxe here. And somehow get my, get my bearings and get back. I'm pretty sure there's some more. Let's just, uh, I'm just going to do this on camera because we ain't really done any dangerous caving yet, I don't think. Oh, some more over there. So yeah, I don't want to, don't want to vein mine and I definitely want to fortune this stuff. Because the, the way it generates in the, in the normal overworld is normal. And in the mining dimension, it's anyone's guess for me at the moment. 
just get some of the... I really don't want to use Vein Mine. Because FYI, I think Vein Mine does not give you XP. I'm almost sure of it. So what we want to do is definitely just kind of stop this pickaxe from dying on us. And doing this. So I'm going to carry on doing this and I'll meet you back at base. I'm not sure we're going to get all of this done today. We're at 15 minutes or so already. And uh, yeah, I don't know if I'm going to be able to get all this all done. God. And we're a bit squishy still. So, and there's a skelly here. Is that something else looking at me? I don't know what it is. I swear I saw something. And you get like these raw blocks as well in the mining dimension of like tin and stuff. What is that? It's really... Okay, that was really strange. Uh, there is some new stuff in here. This is why. Like spawners. Wait. Apotheosis, right? Apotheosis. Apotheosis. Silk touch. Let's light this up. There's a spider spawner here, so if... A I don't like these. We should be able to silk touch it, right? Okay, there's done... Oh, there's a chest there as well. There we go. We've got diamond. He got blown up. Oh, it's getting a bit crazy here now. Be careful. Uh, let's get rid of some of this junk. Uh, get rid of you, you... You, 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 you. Why not you? What was that? Knowledge of the ages. Enemy drops are directly converted to experience. Ooh. Enderman spawn egg. Are you mad? Okay, so we can have an Enderman spawner any day. We are definitely going to be doing that over a spider spawner. 100%. So I'm going to take that. Why not? totally getting sidetracked here right so let's get yeah let's get back to base oh yeah cooking up all the iron i've just literally done two ore hammers and we now got four stacks of iron on the go right back on track but we're literally not going to be able to get this whole thing done it's going to be a bit of a ride i've literally been caught short this episode but we're definitely going to get the latex going that's definitely on the cards today i definitely want to get that going um, yeah, that's cool. And I've got hamburgers at the ready because of all that vein mining that I've been doing. Oh, I've been busy. Busy, busy bee. And there's, confirmed, there's random spawners in the cave systems now. That's really crazy. That's mad. But, and it's a bit OP when you've got silk touch pickaxe because, um, yeah, you can just, you can just silk touch them. And I was lucky enough to get an um, enderman spawn egg. What can I say? And also, while we're waiting for the, everything to cook, we got some quests here. Uh, elemental craft. A bit of XP and the book. Okay, we'll probably just put the book away. Like so. And yeah, I'm just... I'm going to live off hamburgers soon, what can I say? But yeah, I'm just going to wait for this all to cook, and then we're going to get back on track. I'm going to get some trees on the go. I feel like we could do... Uh, I guess oak. I mean, we don't... Actually, we don't have to. We can just plonk the this this down. So, let me show you what... Actually, no, we'll wait. We'll wait. We'll wait. Right, let's see how my memory serves me, right? So, what we're going to do is we're going to... This, this is so messy out here. It's unreal. Right, Um. so what we're going to do is we're going to plant... Oh, wait. They're facing that way. They face it away from the player. Okay. They, If you give them power, they're like super fast. In fact, that's what we're going to do. We're going to give them power. Have I got any cables on me? I do indeed. So we're going to give them power. And the reason we're going to do that is so that they can really, really do what they need to do. Um, so... I guess like this. Okay, that do. And then we've got to somehow get this to play nice. Perfect. Put that on there. That on there. 
down there. Is that going to power up? It has indeed. And that should be a lot quicker, right? So when I plonk this in the middle, that should that should break a lot faster, he says. Famous last words. So what they're going to do is they're going to extract fluid from this, which is going to be latex. We need quite a bit of this stuff, and we're going to funnel it out, which is what we're going to do. I'm uh, probably going to move this off camera just to get like make the thumbnail a little bit more neat and tidy because this is like quite crazy at the moment. So yeah, I'll probably make the thumbnail look completely different, but we'll see. Um, yeah, we're getting a decent amount there. It's actually a lot faster. I wouldn't say it's amazingly fast, but... Hmm. Okay, it, it, it will do. It will do. And then what we're going to do is we're going to literally get some of these mechanical pipes here. And plonk one on each one. And we should be able to still place in the middle. Let me check. Let me check. So we should be able to aim in the middle and still place it. Yeah, perfect. And then what we're going to do is we're going to literally just put it into another machine. I'm hoping that we can, if it needs power, then we're sorted, right? I just put the power there. Um, there's not enough power probably generating that's actually going to make this work because, yeah, I could hook it up to the generator, actually. I should have done that. But I'm just trying to get this done ASAP because this, this process is now, like, turning into multiple episodes. But there's stages to this and at least then you can we can focus on what these guys do and then a little bit more in depth I guess because the episodes are taking a little bit longer than I thought so I, I was hoping to get this all done in one episode but it's, it's fine it's fine it's filler right so the next thing we need to make is a latex processing unit I'm not sure if we've got enough for this oh we need a bucket of latex but that's fine we got that on the go uh, so we need we need two buckets. Where are my buckets kept nowadays? So this is all to get like the latex, and we can use buckets as as you can see. Um, and if we haven't got buckets, we can make them. We got one. Have we only got one. Like seriously. And then, yeah. So we can take we can take the latex out. That's not a problem. We're gonna need a a bucket of water here. And what was it, a latex? And then we need one of these guys. Have I got one? I've got loads of redstone out of all that. That was a good good run. Random run as well. Not enough redstone, to be honest, because you're going to go through... In these mod packs, you go through iron and redstone like, like nobody's business. And... If the, oh, if FYI, at the moment, they're making it so the iron golems get... Um, spawn eggs in 1.19.3 hopefully this pack goes to 1.19.3 which means we get spawn eggs uh, of golems if we got the capturing enchantment we can cat we can hopefully get a we can make loads of uh hopefully make loads of iron golems and get an egg from it and then put it in the spawner and then you've got uh the easiest iron spawner ever iron farm i mean um so we need you one of you. We're going to need a furnace. And then, what else are we missing? Latex bucket and one of these. That's fine. We can get the latex bucket now. I'm pretty sure because we've powered it up, it's going to be really, really good. Okay. So if we get the latex, we should be able to right click now. There we go. And then we should be able to make the processing unit. I'm pretty sure it needs power. Yes. So does it face us? It does. Nice. And we got power and we've got pipes. So at the moment, the pipes, the mechanical, fl so these fluid pipes, mechanical pipes from mechanism are not configured yet. Uh, what is it? N. So we've got to go to fluids and we want that to be the same because that's the destination, but we, we want to extract. So that's like pushing in. This is gonna pull out. This is gonna pull out. This is gonna pull out. And that's gonna pull out. 
So all four of them are now pulling out and putting into the uh, latex processing unit. So hopefully this is, once it's got enough, it should start processing, right? Right. You can fully automate this, but I'm not going to because I don't need to right now. Uh, why you not work? Redstone is ignored, but how much do you need? Like, I would have thought it, was, it would have processed by now. Huh. Uh, redstone is ignored. Why are you not working then? Oh. Do you need water? Okay, you need water, I reckon. Let's go and pinch our sink a minute. And just plonk that next to it. Is that going in? Have I got any more mechanicals? Okay. Let's just plonk it here for a minute and then place a mechanical right here. And then... Extract. Oh, God. And then extract it. Like that. I think you need water. There we go. That's why you're not working. So it needs water as well. I completely forgot. And then you make these tiny rubbers, which in then in turn, we we should be able to go and cook. So I'm going to make a ton of these off camera in between this episode and next. Oh, we've run out of... Wait, what? We've run out already? Fuel? Oh, look how rich we are of iron right now. Like, iron is super easy to get hold of. Especially when you've got the tools to do it. Right, so what we do is we take that out. And we can then cook these, I, I guess. Wait, no. Oh, yes, of course. We need nine of these. Sorry, I'm, I'm refreshing my memory as we go. We're doing this together, right? So we need nine of them. So if you put nine of them in the crafting table, like so, you get dry rubber. And then we just cook that. And that turns into plastic, I believe. Like so. Which in turn will enable us to make the dissolution chamber. Because, oh, we might be able to make... Oh, we might be able to make that now. Yes. Which means next episode we can focus on the pink slime. And we can focus... Oh, wow, that's only... Yeah. So we still need... You need 18 altogether. How much have we got now? You get quite a lot as well from each each log. And that should be enough. Perfect. It's a bit grindy at first, but it's fine. And then we just cook that one up. So can we make... We're going to make the dissolution. Is that... What's that called? Dissolution, yeah. So we need four diamonds. And we can make a diamond gear. Like so. And then we got we got that. We can make oh we missed an iron. Oh yeah, I put it back. And we can make two of you. And now we've got four. I just realized I've got some. Okay, it's fine though. We're minted. We are absolutely minted, mate. Um I'm gonna need a chest. Gonna need a chest and I'm missing one plus wait. Oh yeah. I am getting ahead of myself. So we're missing you. And now we're missing you. Redstone heavy, like nine just for that. Early game is a killer. And now we make the dissolution chamber. Have I got any more cables kicking around? I, I hope I have. Hmm. That's a trans item one. What could we get rid of? Like, I guess I could just stick it there. Like that. Oh, it works. <laughs> but we need to get pink slime in it. 
Uh, I think we could just use a bucket to get the pink slime, but this is kind of a really fancy, let's call it uh, a, f a fancy crafting table, right? So imagine it looks complicated, but really it's got nine squares. If you include the middle, it's nine crafting spots, right? So it's like a crafting table, but you just need to put fluid in the middle one pretty much. And then you've got the eight. Yeah, uh, I'm not sure if it needs water though but that can be we can hook water up to it it's not a problem uh that is actually really easy but yeah we pretty much got the dissolution chamber ready to rock i think we're really like skimping it right now i mean that's got osmium in it i don't really want to break that that is empty i don't really want to break that though that's not empty we're not really using the smelter, are we? Let's be honest. And then we can just get rid of that. In fact, we just we we swap them, swap them for now. I just I'm really really cheaping out, like super cheaping out. Let's put the the solution chamber there, and then that's cool. I'm curious. I'm curious if it needs water before we go. And then we're pretty much halfway. We just need to sort the animals out. And then we have to, so we need to get the pink slime. We don't need a lot of pink slime, but I need to take care of them anyway. So that's going to put it to good use. It looks like it does need water. Oh, wait. Wait. Okay, we can take it out by putting it in there, right? We don't need, okay, so it doesn't need water as such. I think that's the output, fluid output, maybe, possibly. Again, it's been a while. So we put that back and can I put it back in? Yes, cool. Okay, that's going to do it for today. I, I, I feel like it has blown my head. I'm like most of it I spent mining and getting stuff. But for the best part, we've got this going. We, we, we've got the first steps of disenchanting this bad boy into this. And hope I hope it works. I mean, it's, we're going to need it anyway. Disenchanting is very OP when you get it going. But I hope it works because we can get all the modium that we ever need. Ever. It's going to be great. Anyways, thanks for watching. Hopefully you've enjoyed this episode. I shall see you in the next one. Take it easy. Dibs out.